How you do the disco? How you do the disco? I don't know. It's <laughs> not funny. Hey, hey friends, and welcome back to our channel. Yo, and wait, hold up, start over. Hey everybody, welcome, welcome. We oh are back. Back. And it has been a minute, but we are back. Yes. We spent a lot of time, you know, trying to get settled in mm -hmm. and still trying mm -hmm. to get settled in mm -hmm. and working and a whole bunch of other things going on but enjoying the married life right the married life and our know, staycation you know since we couldn't go off on a honeymoon yeah so we are back though it's been a interesting some interesting times going on but we are here and we are alive and well and our families are alive and well and well so i hope your families are doing good during this time as well too so we are here, and what do we have here? We're doing a mukbang. What's a mukbang? Mukbang, mukbang. What is that? Mukbang. What is it? <laughs> so basically, we're gonna eat and talk. Updates. Our life updates. It's been what a month or so, almost two months, since we actually had a sit down video. I know we posted our vlog from our wedding, the footage that we ended up getting. Yeah, just to kind of give you guys an update. Um, and we're calling it a mukbang so that we can smack freely and not be judged, okay? Yeah, because that's my... And I'm hungry because I haven't really eaten much all day. So, that being said... Let's get it. It's called a mukbang, but what is it, where is this food from? Oh, this is from Chong Man's Chicken. Chong Man's Chicken? Chong Man's Chicken. It's Korean fried chicken and fries because I'm really basic. It's called um, soy chicken. Was it soy chicken? Yeah, I think it's. I've yes. never had soy chicken, so this is my first time. She says it's good, mm -hmm. but I'll be the judge of that because I don't yes. just eat anybody's chicken. I've had it before. Ooh, can you get the ketchup, babe? Please. Look at that convenience. Oh, and we have a lot of our furniture in, so our furnished home tour is on the way. Yeah, we're still working on that one, but I think all we have left. We're to almost do is there. The office. We finally just got our table. Like, well, a week or two ago. Y'all don't know the struggle. Like, when we first moved here, we didn't even have a washer and dryer for, like, a month. Like, yeah, it almost was definitely a, month. a month. It was the struggle was real. Oh. Going back and forth up the road just to wash clothes, huh? Can we, uh, can we pray? Mm. Amen. Yeah, it was definitely a struggle going what? between our old condo in here to get our clothes washed. Mm-hmm. Huh. That was the. I think that was the only downfall. Yeah. And still having to pay rent. Yeah, definitely. When we weren't living there for the last month, because our lease wasn't up until August first. It was a struggle. It was real. Mm -hmm. We made it. We made it. Mm -hmm. I could wash and dry. Got a table. Got a sofa sectional. <clears throat> Some other stuff. Mm -hmm. um, still waiting on getting the office together. Mm -hmm. But we're almost there. You have the furniture for the office? Yeah. We, <clears throat> it's spicy. We just need your... um. We got to get your chair. I thought we was getting you a chair. Okay. Well, you want to keep that one? No. Nope. I'm going to keep one. Nope. I'm too late. You keep it like you said. Mm. Can you give me a um, like paper good, towel? good amount of paper towel? Mm -hmm. This is not bad. It's spicy though. It is spicy. This is a good go. amount of paper towel. Okay. What is this? I'll give you all the paper towel. <laughs> it's spicy, isn't it? You try to kill me. Mm. 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 And this is um cran mango. If you've never had any of the crayon line, <laughs> if you've had, if you never had any of the crayon, whatever line, like crayon mango, crayon apple, crayon grape, I think that's ocean spray, I want to say. But yeah, the crayon mango is my favorite. You 
dying out, leave you enough ketchup? Nope. <laughs> mm. That's right in front of your face. Mm -hmm. Babe, move it in front of your face. Oh. <laughs> mm. Yep. Well, we are here. Still trying to get settled in. We've only been here like, what, two months? Um, almost two months. Not even two months. Ago. Actually, what's today's date? The 28th. Actually, it's a little over two months. We closed on the 26th of July. We did. Oh, uh, of June, of June. June, yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we got one more month. September will be three months. Yep. I don't even feel like it's been that long. Like, I still walk around here in such awe of, like. There's still some getting used to. But I've got a routine down pretty much. Mm-hmm. So, it's not bad. Our kitchen is so similar to the one that we had when we were in the condo. All white cabinets. Right now, we have white countertops. I um, mean, there we had granite, and it was, like, black and gray and white but here we have all white kitchen oh i remember our first video was in the kitchen. was in the kitchen yeah, yeah. you want to know what i love about this kitchen over that one the gas stove yep <laughs> i love gas stoves like that's the best thing not gonna lie, it cooks the food really fast and really even, and I love that. She was skeptical at first, she was scared. Mm hmm. But this isn't a propane, it's not gas like propane, yeah, gas, whatever you want to call it. Mm -hmm. Natural gas, so burns a little bit better. But I like it. I can get the food done a lot quicker than I would with this stupid electric stove. It took forever. One thing I don't like about the gas stove is that you have to clean it. You know, clean the electric stove too. No, I mean like you have to take it apart to clean it. You can't just go wipe it off. You gotta like... Pros and cons with something that heats up 10 times faster. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. Mm-hmm. Uh, we are taking it day by day. Yeah. And Jax, our puppy, it's our not dog a puppy. Go. Jax, our dog go. He loves it here. He does. Where are you right now? On the table. No, Waiting for somebody to drop food. Look behind you. <laughs> Waiting for me to drop food. Yep. No Jax. You know what the real question I have for y'all is? Are y'all drum or flat people? Huh? Which one's better? There's a whole debate. What are you talking about? Like the part of the chicken. Do people prefer like uh -huh. the drummy part or the flats? The flats? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You mean the wings? No, we, these are flat. We call them flats. The flats. Oh, well, I guess. I mean, it's all wings, but like, what part? I probably prefer the drum. Just because you don't know how to eat the flats correctly. It's more meat. It is, and that's why all your plate is drummies. Damn. <laughs> I just know it, though. That's how well I know you. This shit is spicy, y'all. It is. It's still good. I'm like sniffling. <laughs> right. But oh, everything's going good in y'all lives right now, you know? Mm -hmm. Everybody's trying to make the most of everything. You know? Mm-hmm. So that's where we've been. Just Getting an married and buying a house during a pandemic is a lot, man. You can do it though. And going to work during a pandemic. That too. It's just stressful. We are trying, you know. Mm -hmm. We're just living our lives. 
normal people. Yeah, I've heard the question people ask us all the time, like. What? <laughs> people ask us all the time, like, how's the married life? And, um, you know, how's the new house? I'm like, honestly, everything just happened so fast. Right. Like, feels good to be married. But other than my last name changing, I think we've been pretty much. Yeah, it don't the feel same. that. It really don't feel that different. Like, mm -hmm. people ask me, like, how do you feel being married? I'm like, other than this, I mean, obviously. You have to hold yourself to even more like better standards as far as your relationship goes, because mm -hmm. you don't just expect oh because you're married and that don't mean that means nothing changes. There's things that do change, yeah. Yeah, you work on stuff and yeah, you, you yeah, there's there's things you have to follow, but as far as just our connection and who we both are, how we communicate and things like that, everything just kind of just transferred over and it just keeps moving, you know. Mm -hmm. We still got things to work on. We're not perfect, but right. I think we're doing a pretty good job compared to where we were when we first started, you know, dating, dating years yeah. ago. Yeah, and I was just thinking that too, like we've grown so much. I mean, granted, we've known each other for what, like 11 years now? And we've dated for like nine and some change of those years. Mm -hmm. But honestly, like I get excited to come home every day. Like, not even just because we got a new house and it's still, like, fun and exciting. But, like, just to come home to him every day and to play Call of Duty or cook dinner together or just, like, veg out on the couch because we both had really long days. Like, I really look forward to to that. And there are days where, like, like I said, we have bad days. But I think we got to a point where, like, we know not to bring those days, like, to each other. In a, in a sense of like we don't take out how we how our days went on each other like hey you had a bad day i need a couple minutes to decompress and we can chill you know right. what i mean like that's the that's the one thing that i absolutely love that i can say is different because in the condo i'm not gonna say we didn't have that luxury but that's in that aspect is, it feels different to be able to come home to your house that y'all own that we own and let me tell you something chill. real quick like i've been preaching this for a long time as far as like how i hate when my car is sitting out in the parking lot mm -hmm. next to random people getting dinged and stuff when they open their doors like they um when I first drove my car home for the first time from work, hit that garage door open and pull right in that garage, I swear, man. I was at peace at that moment. Mm -hmm. I was at complete peace. I was like, this this is all I wanted. And it's not, you know, to say that, what? What happened? Nothing, I'm making a mess, but continue. Well, you know, it's not to say that I wasn't grateful for, you know, where we started, because I definitely was. Mm hmm but my preference is I'd rather our cars be off the street. I feel more comfortable and more secure having the car off the street, like he was saying, inside of the house. So I'm definitely grateful for that. Mm -hmm. I don't ask for much, but when it came to buying the house, that was, that was mandatory. There was no other option for me. If I came outside and somebody just was like, forget your car. Yeah. <laughs> so. Wow. I've seen it happen a lot. God has blessed me. Yep, so. Yeah, but. Mm -hmm. We are. Just trying to make it. Mm -hmm. Work got really busy all of a sudden. Oh, yeah. 
we're on this weird work schedule. So basically they want us to cram a week's worth of, so like five days of work into three days. What cycle did you put the the <laughs> wash machine on? Why are they doing that? It's not a regular cycle. You must put too much. Um, no, you saw the load before I put it in there. You put clothes in there. You put on medium. I can't remember. Wow. Where's the burden on this chicken, baby? It was good. Good. Yeah. It was good. You full? No. You still have more food, by the way. Let me get some more later. I must say, I didn't give you all your food. Let me get some more later. It takes him like 10 minutes to inhale his food. Because <laughs> I don't play when it comes to eating. And it takes me like 20. To be honest with you, eating and talking at the same time is something I hardly ever do. I know, but when I'm very pony, look at that. Let me see. <laughs> but yeah, so. It tastes like soy chicken. You don't? Uh -uh. But yeah, that's something I normally don't do. Like, I'll just eat, and people be watching, me like, dang, he almost done. That's because y'all talking. Uh mm -hmm. What's the point of talking? It's time to eat. I'm <sighs> full, and I only had like six chickens. Dang. What? Stop talking. Eat. <laughs> That's what I've been wanting to say. No, but like, like if hey. you eat slower, you give your body a chance to be like, whoa, I'm full. Well, and it stops you from overeating. Like if you just take short like breaks between each mouthful of food, your body has a better chance. I think that's your hypothalamus. I'm not sure. I graduated college a few years ago, but... It tells your brain that you're you're full and it tells you to stop eating. But there's like some time before that can register. And most of the time we just shovel food into our mouths and then we regret it later when we've overeaten but we didn't realize we didn't adapts. give our bodies a chance to be like, stop. My body adapts. It My knows. body adapts. It knows. It knows. It knows <laughs> when, when it's time for me to stop eating. She barely ate anything. Like I ate one, it's almost two, almost like three, I don't four. understand. That's five chicken. Somebody says they're so starving and they can eat a horse or something. I never said I could eat a horse. And they That's eat like really four hungry. pieces of chicken and some fries and like ah. There were a lot of fries. <laughs> there were a lot of fries on my plate. Okay, my food. Mm. Mm. Well, I think that's all we have. For now. This is intended to be like a, a quick video just kind to of, kind of give you, you guys know, an update. Say we're alive and well. And well. And married. Like, oh. <laughs> when you make that face, it looks like a baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They will order stuff and then just let it sit. Like. It's a cue. It's like. It's you know, cute. it's like when you, when you, you know, something that, like when you, when you print something on a computer. See, you're taking way too long when to you print explain something, that, that means when it's you not When you print even something legit. on a computer, if you print, if you print something and then you go to another page and print something, it's like a cue. It just adds up over time. Eventually that printer is going to get to it and print out whatever you need, but it takes time Why to get Why you got a printer reference? It takes time to get there. You printer professional? Because I used to work on them. The big ones. <laughs> I'm full. <laughs> that was the little voice in my head saying, stop eating. All right, I'm done. So <laughs> thank you all for tuning in. Yes, look at your our, ring. It's so nice. To our you. problem. What is it made out of again? It's, um... What is it? Tunstall? Tungsten. Tungsten. Tungsten is uh, Jason's last name. This is really awkward. 
This is high you, wall. I know what you meant, yeah. This is high <laughs> wall. Shout out to my man, JT. Yes, JT. You was real. You were real. Okay. And congratulations. I'm going to give y'all a shout out because they are so bomb, okay? I know. We got to bring them on. We do got to bring them on as a guest. All right. That's all we have. We'll keep you guys updated with the um, furnished house tour video. Mind you, it'll be furnished, but it won't be like fully decorated. There's so much stuff we want to do, yeah. but you got to do we that. We still haven't even mounted the TVs yet. And we oh, God. Still got to get that done. But we'll get to it. So, thank <laughs> yeah, you Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you all for tuning in. <laughs> we appreciate your time. Yes, and we appreciate all of your love and support and your patience during this time of transition. You guys are special. Only you can prevent forest fires. What? I'm so confused. Huh? I'm so confused. What are you talking about? <laughs> so, thanks guys. We are going to continue with trying to be more accurate and effective in releasing content at a timely manner. Every but week, we pro we keep saying that. We keep saying it, and then it'd be like two months later. <laughs> like we're trash. I'm we sorry. Trash. We're working on it's it. It's her fault. No, no, no. Maybe a little bit. I'll share fifty fifty of that responsibility. Yeah. But we have great ish lighting now. These aren't even all the lights. We're still missing like two or three so we'll definitely be recording for you guys and if you haven't seen our um empty house tour video check that out right here i'm gonna try to put it right here on the food no like right here okay thanks for watching friends tune in next time yes bye <laughs> you need to let me just talk because you're getting on my nerves. All right, go you're ahead. You're saying the same stupid stuff. Three, two. Hold on. Okay, go Three, two. And he threw it away. It was, it wasn't no, it was one of those chairs like from the freaking like when you go to like if you like when you was back in high school, one of those chairs in like the computer room, the little crappy one that don't even have the back. No, it had a, it had, back. Had a back. It had a back, but it was disconnected from the bottom, so it was just. It like wasn't the disconnected. It was. It was one piece. This, this is, is a the, piece this of is the back. Crap. This is the chair, and this is the back. Yo, right? It like it was like that. It was dumb. I threw it away. It was worthless.